What is up guys, this is Shads from Shads Gaming. Today I'm coming to you with a tutorial on how to create a YouTube account and a YouTube channel. Now let's not get those things confused, they are very different things. Um, a YouTube channel is a channel that will allow you to upload videos to YouTube and share them with the world or private or however you set the privacy options within that video. A YouTube account will allow you to interact with other people that upload videos to YouTube. It will allow you to leave comments on their account and interact with them. So let's jump right into it. Let's go to YouTube. So when we go to YouTube, as you can see, we're not logged into any accounts. It's Steph sign in at the top. YouTube doesn't have a register button. What you do, you have to click the sign in button. And then here, it'll ask you to sign in. Yeah. So what you do now is click more options and then click create account. So from here, this will allow you to create a Google account. Yeah. But what we want to do is click this. I would like a new Google address. So fill out all your details. Like so. And you shouldn't need the, the other info here. So hit next step. Privacy, yeah. You should read it if you already read it. Go down to the bottom and click I agree. And as you can see, as it says, it's created me an email address, shadstutorials at gmail.com. Says thanks for creating a Google account, and then you can click continue to YouTube. So when we do that, if we look up the top now, click here, it says you're now signed in under the account that you've created. So what this will allow you to do it will allow you to leave comments on videos. So let's have a look. Let's uh, go to one of my friend's YouTube channels. It's Brian. In this. He, uh, he does all sorts of meditation videos, brilliant videos. Go check out his channel. So let's go to one of his videos. Let's go to videos and we'll do this one and then what we can do now it says here look commenting publicly as Shad ZB now if I wasn't logged into YouTube it would just say comment publicly and when you used to click here instead of giving you a line where you can enter text it would take you to another web page and ask you to sign in whereas if I now Leave a comment. Like so. And click on comment. You'll see I've now got a comment on this channel. On this video, I should say. If you are looking to create content on YouTube, however, you still need to follow all the same steps that we've just done but what you also need to do is create an actual channel so that's easily accomplished now you've got an account what you do is you click up here again yeah and click on my channel so it says here uploads only you can view you don't have any publicly can't talk today you don't have any public recent uploads so they're not up here so what we can do is we can customize the channel okay so if we do that we can add channel art so we can browse our computer and things like that so I have one so let's do that go to the desktop and we upload the image so this is how it looks on all the different devices okay 
that's fine for me so we'll click select and as you see it's saving and now it's updated okay then we've got the avatar if you click on the pencil at the top this will allow us to edit our avatar it says here it may take a few minutes to show up that's fine so we'll click on edit click on upload a photo we'll go back up on desktop again and there's my avatar click done there it is so now that's uploaded that's all well and good so let's close this tab down so as you see it's not it's not here yet let's try refreshing to see if so yeah as it said it takes a few minutes so that uh, that might not show up right away but that's absolutely fine so if you want to start uploading videos you can do that's absolutely fine as well you can do things like add in sections so you know popular videos and things like that create playlists and channels and you know like you if you want to do start streaming live then you can do that that's absolutely fine let's cancel that we click back up here again and go to youtube settings we'll see the settings for your account yeah so here are if you want to edit the settings for them you can edit your name your nickname things like that things that you registered with and that will apply straight away also from here you can connect certain accounts to this account if you want so you can connect your twitter twitter account and what happens is when you upload videos you can get it to automatically post onto twitter to say hey you know i've just uploaded a new video on youtube come check it out and it'll save you manually doing that got all your privacy settings here as well all your settings for your activity feed likes and subscriptions your notification settings okay and these are all default at the moment as you saw I just created the account so uh, I've not edited any of these playback settings and you can also connect your TV to YouTube as well if you like if we click on here again and click on create a studio here the little tips you see because I've just created the account this is where you would find all the information you need when you've created and uploaded videos to you so video manager would be where all your videos were stored if you was live streaming it would come up here after you'd set it up community this would show you you know who your subscribers are and any comments or if you have any comments that are in holding because YouTube detects them as spam they will come up here as likely spam you could authorize them through and click on a plus sign or a little bin to get rid of them or the plus sign to authorize them onto your video if we go down to channel here so YouTube is going to be changing some of these things very very soon so monetization for instance that's going to be changing very soon and you have to have subscribers and things to be able to unlock certain things on here okay I would actually you know if you are thinking of creating a YouTube channel come here and then verify your account with YouTube yeah it just unlocks a couple of things on here and it makes your life a lot easier analytics analytics will show you any of these things here about your videos so individual videos it will show you its watch time how many views it's had how many comments it's had and it is really handy to let you know what you need to do to make your videos have that bit more of an edge okay um transcriptions is exactly what it says on the tin and create that's just music and audio libraries that you can have that's free for projects so it's basically royalty free music that people create and put out there and go feel free to use it so if you click on YouTube again one last little tip before we wrap this video up is if you click up here and where it says dark theme turn that on I always find it a little bit easier on the eyes 
not be to everybody's taste, but that's absolutely fine. If you don't like it, you can go back up there again and just turn it off. And that is it for today's video. Thanks for watching, guys. If you have any problems with creating a YouTube channel or a YouTube account, feel free to comment below and I will reply to your comment as soon as possible. Bye for now.